This fire engine handled the corners with no problem. Let's slice her right down the middle and find out why. As usual on Sliced, we find ourselves in uncharted territory. So Bud's picked a tool typically used to cut through hard rock at quarries. This is a diamond wire cutter, one of the most complicated and coolest tools that we've ever set up. A 25 kilowatt hydraulic powered machine rotates a continuous loop of diamond encrusted wire at 57 miles per hour. As we pull our fire engine through it, it should slice it in half. It's going to take me and a crew of 10 people to make this happen. The question is, how fast can we do it? Here we go. The green button. Three, two, one. Yeah, baby, look at that. Right now, we're using a wrench to pull it through the wire. Oh, wow. Look at that. Look at this line here, guys. This is a perfect slice with this diamond wire. Our diamond wire was getting hot with our slice. So water is applied to keep the wire cool as it's making the cut. Our diamond wire has already made a beautiful slice up to this point. Now, I'm going to push the fire engine a little bit further. So I grab my pickup truck, put it in four-wheel drive low, and I've got enough power to inch this forward. We're going to hop back in the truck now, push that fire engine right through the diamond wire. It's exciting stuff. You can feel the whole truck shaking as that diamond wire is going through the fire engine. We're really close. We're fighting the sun right now. We're almost all the way through our fire engine. and our fire engine is going to be free, retired in beauty. Like the 4th of July in there, we're about to have independence. Yeah, baby, look at that. I think we have a little separation going on now, gentlemen. We got one strap holding this fire engine together. Wow, look at this. I'm going to call in some friends to help me lay this over. There you go. Yeah! <laughs> Look at this slice right here. Every one of these gentlemen right here slaved today to make this slice a reality. And now let's go and look inside of our fire engine and discover some of her mysteries. A beautiful cross-section of our 500-gallon water tank. Take a look at this. We finally have a great section of our water pump. And you can see the impeller inside that spins our 500-gallon water tank baffles built inside so the water could flow through channels evenly and not slosh back and forth creating an imbalance in our fire engine. That's why she handled so well around the corners without the water sloshing back and forth. If this truck had one big tank the water would slosh dangerously potentially tipping it over but this tank is divided into sections by baffles which break the 500 gallons of water into smaller units. 
so that all the liquid won't collectively throw its weight around, making for a steady ride. The sun is set on our slice, and we never gave up. A beautiful fire engine in service for over 20 years. These men right here helped make this a successful slice. Gentlemen, go, go slice! slice! <laughs>